To access the device status feature in HS3, navigate to the View menu and choose Device Status. A listing of your devices will appear broken down by location. Uh, in this case, we're using Category as a location attribute. Uh, I'm going to click on the Lighting Category, and that will bring up uh, all of the rooms uh, that I've got in this demo and all the devices in those rooms. Now, in order to edit this uh, screen, I want to click on the Edit button up here at the top. That'll put me in edit mode. I can change the size of a room. I can change the location or position of the room. Um, so I can modify the screen quite a bit. Once I've finished doing that, I can also uh, add additional information to the screen by right clicking on a device. Here I'm ticking a number of uh, check boxes there for information I want to display. I can move other devices uh, that are in the room around. And I can also move the location of the information. If there's something I decide I don't want, I can untick the box for it and get rid of it. Now I can right click also on the background if I want to change attributes about the background of the room. In this case, I'm going to change the background color. Uh, this brings up a color picker. I can choose the color that I want and submit that. I can also make the background transparent if I'd like. Just right click again on the background. Um, access the color picker and in the lower right hand corner of the color picker just choose the little X block there and say OK. Once you select that it'll be transparent. If you want to change the font color uh, of, of what's displayed you can do that as well. Again use the color picker for that. Well, once I'm satisfied, I can exit the edit mode. That'll put me into uh, command mode. And now if I click on a device, it'll bring up uh, the command screen. So in this case, I can turn a light on or off uh, directly from this screen. And that's all there is to it.